Hello friends. Welcome to my channel. In this video we will see the steps to create EC2 instance in AWS. Please subscribe to motivate me to bring up more contents on AWS. Creating an AWS EC2 Elastic Compute Cloud instance involves several steps. EC2 is a web service that provides resizable compute capacity in the cloud and you can launch virtual machines instances on AWS using this service. Here are the steps to create an EC2 instance. Sign into the AWS console. Log into your AWS account by going to the AWS management console https colon double forward slash aus dot amazon dot com forward slash and entering your credentials. Navigate to EC2. Once you are logged in, select services from the top menu and then choose EC2 under the compute section. This will take you to the EC2 dashboard. Launch an instance. On the EC2 dashboard, click the launch instance button to start the instance creation process. Choose an Amazon machine image, AMI. Select an AMI from the list provided. An AMI is a pre-configured template that contains the software and configuration needed to run an instance. You can choose from various options including Amazon Linux, Ubuntu, Windows Server and more. Choose an instance type. AWS offers a wide range of instance types optimized for different use cases, example, compute optimized, memory optimized, storage optimized. Select the one that best suits your needs. Click the next configure instance details button. Configure instance details. Configure instance details such as the number of instances you want to launch, VPC settings and subnet settings. You can also add user data scripts, IAM roles and configure advanced options if necessary. Click the next add storage button when you are done. Add storage. Configure the storage options for your instance. By default, AWS provides you with an Elastic Block Store EBS root volume. You can add additional EBS volumes if needed. Click the next add tags button when you are ready. Add tags optional. Assign tags to your instance for easier identification and management. Tags are key value pairs. Click the next configure security group button when you are finished. Configure security group. Security groups act as virtual firewalls for your instance. You can define inbound and outbound rules to control traffic. Create a new security group or select an existing one. Make sure to configure the rules appropriately. Click the review and launch button. Review and launch. Review all the settings you've configured for your instance. Ensure everything is as you want it. Click the launch button. Create a key pair or use an existing one. You'll be prompted to create a new key pair or choose an existing one. Key pairs are used for secure SSH or RDP access to your instance. Download and save the private key file .tum, if you are creating a new key pair as you'll need it to connect to your instance. Launch instances. Click the launch instances button to create your EC2 instances. View instances. You can now view your newly created instances on the EC2 dashboard. Congratulations! You've successfully launched an AWS EC2 instance. You can connect to your instance using SSH for Linux-based instances or RDP for Windows-based instances using the private key file you downloaded during the key pair creation step. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to motivate me to bring up more contents on AWS.